Hey everyone, my name is Theo, oh, and welcome to my YouTube channel. This YouTube channel is going to be called Into the Unknown. This is just a preview of one of my very first episodes. So here I'm staring at a diagram of, of the high peaks of the Adirondacks. As you can see, they're labeled of all, of all mountains. Now, they're not all of the mountains are there, but there's a few famous ones. Now let's go over here with Mount Marcy. The modern route uh, goes from down here, 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 and goes up to the Va the Van Hoevenberg Trail and cuts all the way up he here to M from Marcy Dam and onto the summit. Now for our next mountain, we now we then cut to Algonquin, which is the second one. You'll see that as my first episode in the series. Now. The next one, you know, we are next. The way to get up there, there is the Whale Hills Trail to Marcy Dam, which is right, which cuts right here. You'll find that back at the Van Hoevenberg Trail, which I described earlier. Now, for our next ma <coughs> now for our next next mountains, we are going to take a look at 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 the Great Range Mountains. These mountains have have good history on them. Let's start with Gothics, right here. Your eighth highest mountain. Mountain. It's an incredible view. I haven't been there yet, but I've heard it's phenomenal. Also recommended. Anyway, so the way to get up there <coughs> is to take the Johnsbrook Lodge. <coughs> so the Johnsbrook Hodge, either that, or you can do the Beaver Meadows Falls Trail, which is right here. Here, I am going to do the Ga the the Beaver Meadow Falls Trail just to get it, like up there, and um, then I am going to do these three mountains, and then I'm gonna cut back to to Marcy, RC, and and. And climb through this route and go all the way here and then cut to little haystack right here and this is little haystack right here so I can do those two mountains haystack is the fourth highest in the of the high peaks now now I now for now for beginners in mountaineering I do not recommend this route out from from a haystack to basin because I've read on the internet that it is really dangerous, so I would not re uh, recommend it to anyone unless you are skilled. Now the next one I'm, we're going to take a look at, at is Whiteface. This one, this one I would probably start at the at the Whiteface Landing to like Placid. That's the nearest town from each mountain. So you, so you climb up through here to get at the, this mountain. Now the Dix Mountain, out in this, uh, this is one I've never heard of, but uh, I, but I heard it's it's a really good attraction. So the way people do it is that it's really a great attraction for people who like like the high peaks. Now another trail we are doing. Thing is called is called well um well fortunately it's not on here here but the mountain is called Lower Wolf Jaw. It's similar to Upper Wolf Jaw. I see a range trail to Lower Wolf Jaw Mountain. The route I'm going to be taking has this really nice um slide called the um. Called the Benny Slide Trail. It's really fun. Fun. I haven't heard much about it, but I heard it's really good. So, if you're willing for an adventure or virtual during this uh, th these hard times, I'm I'm join me on my YouTube channel. Well, the YouTube channel is called Into the Unknown. Make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. Comment down below where you want me to go next and. And hit the notification bell to get notified about my latest videos. I hope you enjoy.